Hello everybody and welcome to the video. This is Dolphin. Today, guys, we're gonna video about Harry Potter Magic Awakening. Today, we're gonna I'm gonna talk about how to play the game on PC. I'm gonna give you a few tips and what to do to actually play on PC. Um, I much prefer to play on PC once again uh, because it just doesn't drain my phone battery completely. My phone will go pretty hot and um, it's just better also i like to stream i like to make videos so it's a lot better um the screen is a lot bigger as well so you don't destroy your eyes as well uh, but yeah i'm gonna talk about a few odd ways or a few of the place where you can play online and uh, you can just connect your account nothing wrong with it um, but yeah guys, before we get to the video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, it's free and support the channel a whole lot guys, so if you can, please hit that button, it really would help. Um, also, if you have any question about anything in particular, ask in the comment below and uh, I'll definitely answer. Now, I had a few problems playing this game on PC in the beginning because my usual emulator wasn't allowing me to... Um, to log in into the Warner Bros account so when I was playing on my phone and on the PC it was two different accounts so I had to change it it might not have it might not give you the same problem so I'm gonna mention it it's my favorite emulator although for uh, Harry Potter Magic Awakening didn't work for me and it's called Momo Player I'm gonna write the name of the emulator in the comment below so if you need to check properly how it's written it's gonna be there but it's Momo player really good emulator I've been uh, using it for a while now and I never had problem and also I never I didn't have problem with the game but I couldn't just log in into my Warner Bros account it would be a blank page if you don't have that problem then go for Momo uh, you can try it. it's a really really nice emulator it's super smooth and uh, it's free all of these emulators are gonna be free so yeah you can uh, you can try all of them uh second one and somebody told me what the problem was with it it was uh blue stacks blue stacks pretty pretty uh, known emulator pretty pretty good emulator although i'm gonna say it personally i don't like it i don't find this move i don't find it really stable and uh I did have the download downloaded but I didn't use it much again good emulator but uh, it's not smooth now somebody in the chat yesterday told me that when you download it it come at a 30 FPS setup so you might have to change the setting into 60 FPS and that might actually help you out with the fact that uh, with the smoothness and also when I tried Blue Stacks, um, <laughs> Harry Potter Magic Awakening was just crashing all the time. Get into the game and crash, get out of the game. So I just gave up on it and um, so yeah, you can try, if you have it downloaded already, try it. Probably try the 60 FPS, uh, <laughs> 60 FPS um, setting and it should work well. But now I'm going to mention the player that I'm using now, the emulator I'm using now, it's actually really nice, super smooth. Uh, I had problems in the beginning when I downloaded it because the game was crashing but also when you download the game and you see the, um, the screen welcome to Ogres or enter Ogres, um, wait until it download everything that it needs to download. You need to download chapter one stuff, you need to download the voices and so on so wait for it it's gonna come here like a little circle with the download percentage so wait for it to get to a hundred all of it let download everything and then you can actually enter ogres because i was trying to enter ogres <laughs> while it was downloading and you should be able to you should be able to but it was crashing so try that way let it download it and then enter uh, and like that i didn't crash anymore at all so pretty good player still free uh, all of them are free actually and it's called ld player um pretty good and i didn't have problems at all after that just the first time <laughs> with the crashing but it wasn't even the the i don't i mean i probably was the emulator's fault 
because uh, he couldn't handle the download and the gameplay but after that we were all good now um i think that's it guys i've uh, i've received this question a lot in chat yesterday on stream so i thought maybe i'd make a video tell you guys how to play on pc it's a lot better hopefully they release the client to play to download the PC version already from uh, the Warner Bros website or to Harry Potter Magic Awakening website because that would be even better but yeah if this works so try it um, if LD play doesn't work try the other two all free and uh, yeah guys thank you so much for watching the video I hope you enjoyed it I hope it helps and uh, yeah I'll see you in the next one bye bye buddy take care guys stay safe bye